ladies and gentlemen my first unboxing and what is it 60 70 days i don't know but let's go one stacker on a journey to find silver international stacker all right y'all i've been out here on the east coast responding to this disaster and uh all my silver and gold is in california i do not have one silver dime to my name but i have four boxes to unbox here what can it be let's find out now what i can promise you is there is some silver in one of these boxes let's find out which one all right for all of those of you who watch my live stream you know that lately my phone has been overheating like crazy um what you don't know is i've been having like problems where it's freezing and I have to keep stopping it restarting it so I traded in this phone I'm recording in now for this one and then paid, a, you know, the extra amount. It wasn't too bad to get the new or to get a new iPhone 11. I really wanted to hold out for the iPhone 12, but um, on, look at this. Woo! But unfortunately, the 12 is not going to be out for four months and it might even be longer. So I couldn't wait that long, you know, because the beer flew and all that. So, my videos are going to be better, guys. My live streams are going to be better. And I'm really happy about that. But wait. There's more. Box number two. Let's see here. Okay, let me take the paper out. Box number two. Is slide either the phone... Oh, so this is the box to ship this back. Okay, so that's the box to ship this phone I'm recording on, which is an iPhone X. So the original iPhone 10 is what I'm trading in. I'm getting $320 credit for it, guys, even with the overheating issues. Here's the next thing. And this is going to be massive, especially for my videos. For those of you who watch a lot of my videos, you know that I do a lot of live streams when I'm traveling. I travel a ton for work. I mean, last year I did 100,000 air miles, 100,000. So it's a ton. So the cool thing about this is it's the, and they didn't make these for the X for some reason, I don't know why, but what this is, is it's the phone case battery pack. So it's gonna give me an extra couple, probably hour or two of streaming right there. So there we go, but wait guys. There's another package. What's this? It is the charging station that you set the phone on to charge it. But wait, International Stacker. You opened all the packages and there's no silver. <clears throat> well, I didn't lie. And I want to tell you one of the reasons I stack silver. Because it is the best conductor of electricity in the world this metal is the best conductor so in this phone in that tv there and a lot of the other items um silver is heavily used so one of the things i like to say to my friends or when i'm having this discussion with people is if tomorrow all of a sudden silver was worth zero it had no monetary value no one wanted it for coins anything like that it was worth zero it would still be worth something because one, it's the best conductor of electricity. And some people say, well, what about graphene? Graphene's gonna be work better. But as of now, it's the best conductor of electricity. Two, it's used in water purification. Three, it's used in the medical industry and medical devices. And that segues over to like lifestyle, I guess. Lifestyle. Um, silver is used in things like yoga pants because it's antibacterial, which is why it's used in water treatment as well. So it's antibacterial, so for yoga pants, it takes away the bad smell. Different other garments that people wear have it in there. 
Um, what else is silver used for? Ah, so to piggyback on the best conductor of electricity, green technology. So in California in 2022, it's mandatory for all new houses to have solar panels. So what do you think is going to happen to the demand of silver as green technologies increase, electric cars increase, all these technologies really start pushing forward that need silver. It's going to increase the demand. So even if the monetary demand of silver totally collapsed, you still have an industrial demand. And that's why I love the use case of silver. And piggybacking off that, it's finite. There's only so much of it in the ground. Now, every ounce of gold that's ever been mined is pretty much still above the earth. It might be at the bottom of a sea, you know, sunken treasure chest that we need to go find, but it's above ground. People save it, hoard it, stack it. Silver, on the other hand, a lot of it's been put back underground, thrown away, discarded. Why? Well, the little bits of silver in this, in the TV, um, and missiles. There's silver in missiles, guys. Tomahawk missiles and these different types of missiles have silver. So that gets obliterated and blown up. So you have a lot of the silver that's ever been mined. Most of it has been used, consumed, and has been disposed of. I really strongly believe in the future... You are going to see, I think you're going to see people re-mining like trash dumps. They're going to process trash dumps and find like little bits of industrial gold and industrial silver. So I really believe at a certain point, the demand is going to be there. And wait, there's an opportunity for you all to get some silver right now. Actually, a silver coin, but how can you do it? Sorry guys, I had to come over to my computer and hold the golden shoehorn to read the script. Remember, you all told me to do this. We all knew the market had to autocorrect at some point. <laughs> autocorrect? Correct. <laughs> autocorrect, that's technology. But we all knew the market had to correct at some point, right? How will the markets respond from this point forward? One thing is for sure, you can't flip a switch and return things to normal. That's why Americans are making the decision to diversify into gold. Since 1997, Lear Capital has been America's top choice for gold IRA and precious metal sales. Mention this channel and receive a free silver coin with your first purchase. Call 800-819-2495 now or check out the link in the description. And you know... <clears throat> I do have family members that have IRAs and different types of investments tied up in the market, guys. And if you've been watching my channel, although I'm not a financial investor right now, is definitely not the time to have your money tied up in the market. So if you can put your money <clears throat> that's tied up in the market into some sort of uh, physical gold or silver um, protection, that's what I would be doing personally. And that's what my family members and people who are stuck in the system are doing. Um, so I strongly urge you to take a look at that, whether it's with Lear or whatever other company. But we are due for a reckoning that I hope is not going to come. I hope we can pull out of this and live happily ever, ever after. But unfortunately, that has not happened throughout history. So what do you guys think? Do you like my outlook on silver and why I like it? And even if tomorrow the financial, you know, side of it collapsed, it'd still be worth something. Do you agree with that? Do you think that's stupid and that graphing is totally going to take over? Do you even know what graphing is? What the heck is graphing? Do you all like my purchase of this phone? Now, yes, I could have got a lot of silver or a lot of gold definitely for the price of this phone. But look at it this way. Having this phone, I'm going to be able to bring you guys better filmed content, stream for longer, which means longer journeys, which means longer time searching for Mrs. International Stacker, which means then I'll find her, I'll get married, then she'll have me sell my whole stack, she'll have me quit stacking silver, the world will collapse, the demand for gold and silver will collapse because I'm not stacking anymore, then the channel will get deleted. No! Kill the phone! Just kidding. Anyways, that won't happen because when I find Mrs. International Stacker, I promise all you, if she's not a stacker, she's going to love my stacking. Anyways, guys, thank you for joining. Thank you for watching. Thank you for putting it up with me. 
in coming on these journeys because you all make it a lot of fun. Here's to my new iPhone. Here's to all of you. Let's see what kind of adventures we can go on with this puppy. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll say C-Y-O-T-N-O. -O. Catch you on the next one. Woo! I guess you're not supposed to sing.